Hi everyone, it's Chelsea from Painted Layers, PDF sewing patterns and tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how to sew the Taylor Vest. The Taylor Vest is an easy beginner's vest pattern that will teach you how to attach a separating zipper. This vest is casual and stylish. It looks great paired with jeans and your favorite pair of boots. Check out the link below if you would like to purchase this pattern. first thing you want to do is cut out your pattern and gather your materials. This project will be done completely on a regular sewing machine. Use your rotary cutter and mat to cut out front and back pieces of your outer fabric on the fold. Then use your rotary cutter and mat to cut out one front and one back piece of your lining fabric on the fold. Your pieces should look like this. Use a ruler and rotary cutter to cut a line down the middle of your front pieces for both outer and lining fabric. Next, cut out your rectangle for the collar with the dimensions listed in the pattern. Now, use this rectangle as a template to cut out a second rectangle the same size for your outer fabric. You should have two rectangles, one from the outer fabric and one from the lining fabric. Now take your front and back pieces from your outer fabric and clip or pin together at the shoulder side seams with right sides together. Then use your regular sewing machine to sew along the shoulder and side seams with a 1 4 inch seam allowance. Now take your outer collar piece and place along your neckline. Clip collar into place, lining up the edges with the right sides together and sew into place. Now cut off the edges of your collar so that they are even with the front of the vest. Now take your front and back lining pieces and clip or pin along the shoulder and side seams and sew into place. Now clip your lining collar piece to your neckline with right sides together. Then cut off excess length on both sides of the collar to match the edge of the vest. Check that the length from the collar seam to the top of the collar edge is the same on both ends. Now we will attach the zipper. It works best to attach the zipper to the outer piece first. Start by unzipping your 24 inch separating jacket zipper. With your vest facing right side up, clip the zipper in place along the edge of the vest with the zipper teeth facing inside. Make sure the zipper pull is right sides together with the outer fabric. We will use a zipper foot to attach the zipper. Before you sew, check that the distance from the collar seam to the top of the metal teeth of the zipper is the same on both sides. Then use your zipper foot to sew the zipper along the vest close to the outer edge. Start at the top of the vest and work your way down. Now your vest should look like this. Next place your outer and lining vest pieces together with right sides together. We will now attach the lining and outer pieces together by sewing the side edges of the vest. Position the pieces together lining up the edges. Clip the edges together. The zipper edges should be sandwiched between the outer lining fabric and the teeth facing inward. Then sew the outer and lining pieces together along the top of the collar. Now turn the vest right side out. Your vest should now look like this. Now we will sew around the armholes. Working through the bottom opening of the vest, you want to clip the edges of the armholes with right sides together. Reach underneath the bottom opening and clip the raw edges together. This step can be a little tricky. You may have to add clips from the inside. Clip all the way around the armholes and then sew into place. Now clip off any excess threads.
pull the bottom of the vest back down and your armholes should look finished. Now we are ready to sew along the bottom edge. Position your bottom edges right sides together, tucking the top portion of the vest inside. Line up the side seams and clip or pin into place. Now sew across the bottom, leaving a gap large enough to turn your work, approximately 4 inches. The last step is to close up the gap. You can do this with fabric glue for an invisible finished look, or you can choose to sew it closed. And congratulations, your tailor vest is complete. I hope you get this pattern and get to make one of these yourself. For more sewing videos, please subscribe to this channel and like this video if you learned something new. Thank you and happy sewing.